Right, Councillor Carpenter. Question 32 to the uh, Chairman. Um, I can only assume from Councillor Carp that somehow Councillor Carpenter believes that we're not getting value for money. I think, as I've made clear in my written response, that's not the case. I think it's also perhaps worth bearing in mind that the Vauxhall Nine Elms um, Board, um, to which the Director will report, is not only cross-borough but indeed cross-party. It will be chaired by the leader and his vice-chairman will be the leader of, of Lambeth. Without a professional delivery team, uh, I think we genuinely believe that the redevelopment would not take place, um, the type of, especially the type of redevelopment we want to see, and there would not be the money and new jobs we expect. Supplementary. I just observed that uh, as chair of governors of a school, uh, if I couldn't recruit my head and I doubled the salary, I suspect I would be removed as chair of governors very quickly by the finance director here. But um, actually, I don't. I agree with you. I, I don't. I don't. Uh, I've got no objection to paying uh, private sector salaries for private sector accountability. What I have a problem with is giving private sector sal salaries for public sector accountability i.e. no accountability. Perhaps you could tell me how many directors have, uh, in Wandsworth have been sacked in the past 10 years? <laughs> I've got no idea, having only been a councillor for uh, 18 months, how many have been sacked in the last 10 years, but I'll endeavour to find out and we'll write to it in due course. Councillor McCausland. Um, does the... Um does the, the chairman, I think, um, does the chairman believe that it's um, a bit much of a Councillor Carpenter, uh, despite his, um, I think, uh, quite well-known business experience, to, uh, you know, as representing Labour Party, who have, um, as a government, the previous government, had so many sort of obscure, maybe not £174,000 worth, £150,000 worth, but numerous... Um, posts were, were sort of thought up, dreamed up to expand the public sector. Um, does, uh, well, the question was, um, does he think that's a bit much? Uh, indeed, I, I do. Um, oh, one, one, uh, <laughs> 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 one only has to look at the sort of enormous explosion of Quango crats and everything else that we saw in the 13 years of the Labour government to look at how easy, and I think it's quite surprising when one actually does speak to ministers, that many of them are finding it actually relatively painless to cut back in their departments because actually things did grow too much and they were far too unaccountable. Councillor Rabchek. Question number 33 to the uh, Chairman of the Committee. I thank Councillor uh, Rabicek for his question. I think it's very important we listen to the staff of views who do an excellent job. Um, and I will place a copy of the survey in the members' room for colleagues to see. Um, can the, uh, the Chairman uh, outline what staff succession plans are in place and indeed whether he feels that they are uh, currently adequate? Um, I do believe it's currently uh, adequate. I think uh, this is something that the audit committee uh, on which we both sit regularly looks at um, and it's evaluated uh, on an annual basis. Time for questions is over.